The Will Rogers Follies is a big, huge Broadway spectacle based on the life of Will Rogers, one of our greatest entertainers and humorists. He was actually the highest paid entertainer at the time. Can you believe the price of theater tickets these days? <laughs> When I saw what they were asking for this show, I thought they were still looking for investors. When Will Rogers was performing, he headlined at the Ziegfeld Follies. Mr. Ziegfeld, too. He only put up with my little act to kill time while the girls were changing from nothing into nothing. The Will Rogers Follies is a musical review, the telling of Will Rogers' life as if it were produced by Florin Ziegfeld. All the girls have learned uh, a hand jive and working with ropes and their tap dancing cows and their beautiful Ziegfeld showgirls. <laughs> We've been so lucky to assemble such an amazing, talented group of performers, starting with our Will Rogers, Mark Fushi, who's been working on his trick ropes and all his harmonica and his guitar playing. <laughs> Christmas Carol was running, so we got the stairs really late in the process. We actually rehearsed the whole show next door in the lanyard and had it ready to go. We actually, you know, were ready to run the minute we walked in the door. And our choreographer, New Orleans national veteran choreographer, Karen A. Bear, has been amazing helping me whip all the boys and girls into shape. What's happening in rehearsal is very raw and simple. In the next four days, everything's about to explode. We're going to be getting over 250 costumes with multiple costume pieces for each costume. Um, the challenge is, you know, you have 16 girls. Anytime you need one thing, you need 16 of them. We have a unicyclist and a stilt walker and tap dancing showgirls and tap dancing cows and uh, four children in the show. It's definitely family entertainment. Please also hit the White House. Well, sorry, dancer.